the municipality of Certo Rombos has tried to make two crossings safer. Also at the request of residents who thought the former crossings were unsafe. These crossings have priority for cycling, because the cycleways run right next to two main north-south roads. They are part of a T-junction at either end of a 1970s distributor road, which looks a lot like a main road, because it is much wider than we would build it nowadays. It invites drivers to go fast, and then they tend to overlook people walking and cycling. Everything you saw up to now was the before situation. In November and December 2020, both crossings have been reconstructed. The project was financed by the municipality, supported by a subsidy of the province. The curbs were moved. This made the curves sharper. And it made the roadway narrower. Not the entire side of the road was reconstructed, only the part directly near the intersection. The rest of the road was narrowed with diagonal stripes or chevrons. The design became a little greener. The tiles of the corner islands were replaced by grass once it starts to grow. The crossing is now on a raised table. This means that drivers experience a speed bump when they approach the crossing. All the changes are meant to decrease the speed of motor traffic which means drivers will have more time to see people cycling and walking, and give them priority. Not much changed from the viewpoint of cycling and walking. The red asphalt is still very smooth, and the width of the cycleway did not change. For the pedestrian crossing the curbs are still flush, to make it easy to cross the road in a wheelchair or with a baby carriage. For people who are visually impaired, there are tactile markings to indicate where both car lanes and where the cycleways are. On paper all this should make the crossing safer than before, but it remains a crossing and people can still make mistakes. Unfortunately, one woman on a bicycle was hit by a car driver after this reconstruction. That doesn't necessarily mean the reconstruction was a failure, only after some time it will be possible to say whether the crossing did indeed become safer than before. That is the most likely outcome, but only time will tell. <laughs>